Hello and welcome to a new Kubio tutorial. Today we'll install Kubio from scratch and learn how to make the most basic changes inside the Kubio editor for text and images. First, you should know that Kubio is compatible with any WordPress theme. In this exercise I'm going to use the default 2022 theme. Let's go to plugins inside the WordPress dashboard. Let's add a new plugin by typing Kubio in the search bar. We now need to install and activate the plugin. Now, let's take a look at the starter sites available inside Kubio. Some of these are free, while some are pro starter sites. You can import them right away or try them for free using the Try Online option. If you want to stick with the theme you're using, you can skip the starter sites. From now on, we will edit any page using the Edit with Kubio option. But I'm gonna go with a starter site for now. Next, we're going to modify some existing text. All you have to do is go to a heading or paragraph and delete or add words straight in the canvas. Save the page in order for the change to go live. You can also preview the page. How can you add new text? Text in Kubio actually refers to the paragraph block or the heading block. Let's add a paragraph block below the main heading. We will just drag and drop the block from the block inserter below the heading. Let's add some dummy text here. Now, when you select any element from the page, you will use the block editing panel on the right for customizations. In the case of the paragraph block, we can change text color, font sizes, and so much more. Now, let's add an image. You can proceed the same as I did when I dragged and dropped the paragraph block, but there's another way as well. Hover over the place where you want to add the image until you notice a plus sign. Click on it. A smaller block inserter will show up. Let's look for the image block. When the image block is clicked, it will be added to the page. Now, you can use the toolbar on top of it to reposition the block if you want. You can drag and drop it or move it using the up and down arrows. We can choose an already existing image or upload a new one to the media library. All the site's media assets are placed inside the library, from images to all sort of files. Next, we are going to use the block editing panel on the right to make styling changes. Now, what about backgrounds, sections, columns, rows, and several blocks in Kubio support background changes? This feature is usually found inside the style or advanced options in the block editing panel. Let's add an empty section with three columns and change its background color. We can now use these plus signs to open up the block inserter and add new blocks. And that was all for today. You now know how to install Kubio and make text, image, and background changes. See you next time.